Hello and welcome to Theme Park today and it is day six of our Disney World adventure and today we are going back to Hollywood Studios so we nip on the skyline again and off we go. Oh we're going down. As a reminder these are my first few vlogs on the channel so I apologise if they're a bit shaky or not the best. The first thing we did today was went and saw the Beauty and the Beast show. And this is a really good show. If you're going to Hollywood Studios, I recommend you watch this show. Once upon a time, in a faraway land, a young prince lived in a shining castle. Although he had everything his heart desired, the prince was spoiled, selfish, and unkind. One winter's night, an old beggar woman came to the castle and offered him a single rose in return for shelter from the bitter cold. Repulsed by her haggard appearance, the prince sneered at the gift and turned the old woman away. But she warned him not to be deceived by appearances, for beauty is found within. She had seen that there was no love in his heart, and as punishment she transformed him into a hideous beast placed a powerful spell on the castle and all who lived there. If he could learn to love another and earn their love in return, the spell would be broken. If not, he would be doomed to remain a beast for all time. As the years passed, he fell into despair and lost all hope. Through a series of strange circumstances, she found herself held captive inside a dark and foreboding castle, inhabited by a very odd collection of characters. Master will be furious if he finds out what we are up to. Well, we don't have to tell him, do we? There is nothing to worry about. No, nothing. Just our entire future. Oh, pish posh. But of course, we must make her feel welcome. Her father and her freedom all in one day. 
mean I remind you that your 21st birthday will be here soon? I know that. Perhaps she has come to break the spell. Remember, you must learn to love another and earn their love in return. I know. And then we might all be human again. Yes, yes, human again. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's very good. But I told you never to come here. I just wanted to find out what was the It's everything. none of your business. Please, stop. You shouldn't have come to the West Wing. And you should learn how to control your temper. I, I can't help it. Well, how do you know if you don't even try? Yeah. Your children. <gasps> He'll come after them in the night. No! no one is safe until his head is melted on my wall. I say we kill the beast. Kill him! We're not safe until he's dead. He'll come stalking us at night. Set the sacrifice for children to his monstrous appetite. No we can it on our village. Make sure you do check out that show in full. It's available here on Theme Park today. A link in the description. Make sure you watch that show in full. After we watched that show, we went on Toy Story Mania. It is a 25 minute show altogether, so make sure you do click on that link and watch it after you watch the vlog.
After that, we met Woody and Jesse. It was amazing. After we met Woody and Jesse, we went on the Millennium Falcon. Coming up, we meet Buzz Lightyear. Remember to subscribe and like the video. After Millennium Falcon, we did meet Buzz Lightyear. Footage coming up in just a second. This is where it went a bit wrong though, because we did have to queue up 20 minutes for Buzz Lightyear. And then we got to the front of the queue and it rained, poured. So Buzz had to go inside and then we had to re-wait for him afterwards. But we did eventually get him. Remember there are links in the description for videos if you'd like to rewatch any of these videos on their own. Here he comes. Here he comes.
Good stuff. What? He doesn't do autographs. Doesn't he? No. Oh. She just said. All right. He doesn't do autographs. No. He doesn't do no, that's right, Buzz Lightyear does not do autographs. After Buzz Lightyear, we finished our day six here in the Hollywood Studios with a visit to Lightning McQueen's Racing Academy. My best is Buddy Lightning McQueen. Don't ask me to introduce him. So I put together a little thing I call Lightning McQueen, the untold story that ain't done yet been told. <laughs> and here it is, singing style. Oh, <laughs> I gotta push the button. Shoot. I knew that. Here's a story of a car. Piston Cup Racer, rookie star. End of the season went that far to a crazy three way tie. Everybody say, hey! because I had a great teacher, Doc Hudson. That's why I started this racing academy, so I could pay that forward to all of you. Uh, buddy? <laughs> yes, Mater? Doc wasn't the only one that taught you a thing or three. <laughs> That's right. He taught me how to drive backwards, how to tip tractors, how to be a great friend. Yeah, and then you went on to win a heap of piston cups. Whee! Now, winning is great and all, but Doc taught me at the end of the day, without your friends, it's just an empty cup. Doc's passion for racing was inspiring. If he couldn't outrace them, he would outthink them. Ladies and gentle cars, the fabulous Hudson Hornet. Wow. Now, to kick off today's lesson, I'm gonna take a few laps on a simulator. I know what you're thinking. Simulators and I don't get along very well. Uh, did you have to show that, Mater? Well, it makes you more dramatic. Yeah. But that's not going to happen this time, thanks to the tech-savvy rookie sensation and my friend, Cruz Ramirez! Hello, everybody! After today, you'll be ready to meet it, greet it, and defeat it! Exactly! Made her boot up the simulator! You got it! What? Oh, oh gotta push the button. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong button! Uh, right! And you see yeah, now that's what I'm talking about. Here we go, rookies. Help me with the countdown. Three, two, one, go! All right, it's always good to start with a practice lap. Warm up your tires. Now, when you're racing, you want to keep an eye on your tire pressure, oil level, and fuel. Exactly. As you get started, get used to the speed for a moment and pick a line and stick to it. Uh-oh, congestion ahead. What should we do, Cruz? Imagine a stampede and hit a window. Just like Spooky taught us. Sorry, rookies. I don't know how that happened. 
happened? Wait, the simulator was corrupted. I'm rebooting it now. Got it, okay. Now, it's important that you train on a variety of tracks. Let me show you. Select Tokyo, Japan. Opening Japan. Are you afraid to go for a drive because of a leaky tailpipe? What? I'm Lightning McQueen for Leak Less. Hit the trail without leaking on the trail. Ah, uh, that was only supposed to air overseas. In our universe, there is only one race car that stands above the rest. Doc Hudson? Uh, one race car who is the champion of champions. Mr. King? No, you know him as the greatest racer of all time. Oh, uh, Mikey the Queen! No, Chick Hicks! Oh, Chick Hicks? That's not who I was thinking of, but okay. Hey, McLoser! Chick, what are you doing here? Well, I hacked into your silly simulator so I can race you and finally prove who's the best race car. Me or me? Chick, you already beat me in a race. Everyone says I only won that cup because you were helping the king. They say my championship was a fluke, which it wasn't. I'm here to settle this once and for all. Let's race, McQueen! I am not racing you, Chick. We're busy training these rookies. Oh, yeah? I'll sweeten the deal. If I win, every racer here gets a huge pile of cash. Must be appropriate age and real base to claim a huge pile of cash. Not responsible for lost or stolen items. One huge pile of cash for winning customer. Offer not available in Orlando, Florida. Ah, uh, come on. Leave the rookies out of this. I knew you were afraid to race me. <laughs> <laughs> what do you rookies think? Should we race this guy? Yeah, you can beat him. Yeah. Oh, yes. You should race Chick. Even though he's so much better. <laughs> Come on, you the queen. All right, let's do this. Mater, start up the simulator. On it. Please select a course. Check it, motor speedway. Come on, is that even a place? <laughs> it is now. All right, three, two, one. Wait, I'm facing the wrong way. That's too much.
But Chick reminded me that in the end, racing isn't about speed and flash and crossing the finish line. It's about the journey you take to get there and who you've got driving alongside you. No <laughs> way. I'm getting all rusty-eyed back here. <laughs> Thanks for coming out today. Consider yourselves honorary members of my Lightning McQueen racing team. Now go out there and get your tires dirty. ka -chow! Have a great drive, everybody. We'll see you Thank you so much for watching this vlog. Remember to subscribe to the channel, smash a like on the video. That is the end of day six in Hollywood Studios. Make sure you join us on day seven when we are back in Epcot.